Multiple network intrusion attempts have been detected. This seems like a coordinated attack. Alert the agencies immediately. We must not let them into our system. On it. Most of the threats have been mitigated. However, one intrusion attack may have been successful. We are still investigating. Responders from the Singapore Civil Defence Force have arrived, leading the response of the fast response bike and the light fire attack vehicle, also known as the Red Rhino. Swift and nimble, both vehicles are often first to arrive on scene during emergencies. Entering the promenade is the pump ladder, commonly known as the fire engine. It is the backbone of our frontline response against fire and rescue incidents. The emergency medical service have also arrived to attend to the casualty. The fire bikers trained as emergency medical technicians have started stabilizing the casualty. Concurrently, the ambulance crew are ready to evacuate the casualty. Using the operational medical network's informatics integrator on board the ambulance, our paramedics are able to provide real-time updates of the casualty's condition to the hospital. All firefighting assets are now in position. Watch as they come together to extinguish the raging fire. Threat is formed as a result of the fire. A hazardous gas leak has occurred. Emerging from the gallery are the unmanned firefighting machine and the pumper firefighting machine. Remotely operated, these machines allow our responders to contain the hazardous gas threat from a safe distance. Look to your right, arriving on scene are the hazmat mitigation vehicle and the utility buggy. The hazmat mitigation vehicle transports our hazmat specialists and their equipment to the incident site, while the buggy enables swift evacuation of casualties. The unmanned machines have started their operations to disperse the hazardous gas. Watch as our hazmat specialists tackle the gas threat. The gas leak has been successfully mitigated. Well done, SCDF. Guys, you got CDC news about the active shooting in Singapore. Active shooting? Breaking news. Eyewitnesses oh have confirmed that a few gunmen have entered the building. At the time of the incident, multiple gunshots were heard around the area. We also have reports that at least 10 civilians were inside the building. Officers from the Singapore Police Force are responding. We will bring you more updates as the situation unfolds. Hearing the gunshots, the in-situ reaction team, IRT, from the Singapore Police Force have been activated. While waiting for more reinforcements to arrive, the IRT negotiates with the hostage-taker to stall for time. 
arriving to reinforce the team from both sides of the promenade are the ground response force and emergency response team. The next tier of responders will now advance forward with a tactical assault. Watch as the Special Operations Command's armed strike team completely overwhelm the remaining gunmen. One of the gunmen has left behind a suspicious package. Making its way into the promenade is the remotely operated vehicle, or ROV, used by our Army's Explosive Ordnance Disposal Unit. Watch as the robot investigates and neutralizes the suspicious package. The EOD operator has given the all-clear sign. The coast is clear. Please give the Singapore Police Force and the Singapore Army a big round of applause. This is breaking news. This is breaking news. In what experts described as how perfect storm at the. Officers are responding. Entering the promenade is a combined task force comprising the rapid deployment troops and fast response car from the Singapore Police Force and the Peacekeeper Response Vehicles from the Army Deployment Force. They have been activated to block the hijackers from proceeding further. Turn to your right as the hijacked bus races onto the promenade. in hot pursuit our elite troopers from the special operations task force you may want to cover your ears as they're about to make an explosive entry the hijackers have been neutralized Watch as our special forces hand over the hostages to the Army Deployment Force, who will escort them to safety. are rescued and all threats have been neutralized well done SPF and SAF